Additional Sessions Judge Afzal Majuka has issued a written order for Thursday's hearing of Imran Khan and his wife, Mrs. Bushra Khan's iddat or unlawful marriage case. Neither Mrs. Khan's ex-husband, Khawar Manika, nor his lawyer showed up at the hearing despite a certified copy of the High Court's decision being presented which asked for their presence. A notice to Khawar Manika and his lawyer has been issued to meet the demands of justice. The order from the Sessions Court states that if Khawar Manika or his lawyer do not appear on June 21st, then a decision will be made based on the available records. The former Prime Minister and First Lady continue to be unjustly incarcerated for 314 and 136 days, respectively, merely for getting married. Imran Khan's Pakistan Tehriki Insaf has rejected the, quote, anti-people federal budget, end quote, which offers no relief for the common man from crippling inflation. The government unveiled an unrealistic 18.9 trillion rupees highly inflationary budget aiming to keep political allies sweet with lavish spending promises. Price hikes across the board from petrol to milk, including infant formula, and steep new tax rates will take a sizable bite out of household incomes due to abnormally high new tax rates. In addition, due to shortfalls in external borrowing, the illicit government of Pakistan has increased local borrowing and artificially controlled the exchange rate. Such is the state of lawlessness in Pakistan that the finance minister delivered his budget speech without the finance bill having been laid before the National Assembly. PDS Interim Chairman Barrister Gohar Ali Khan has said that this government does not have a legitimate mandate and is disconnected from the ordinary people of Pakistan. Journalist and senior anchor Imran Riaz Khan has been booked in yet another case. He was arrested at the Lahore airport on Tuesday night and presented before the court on Wednesday. Imran Riaz was traveling to Saudi Arabia to perform Hajj when men in plain clothes who had accompanied uniformed police arrested him. No arrest warrant was produced. Imran Riaz was previously abducted and forcibly disappeared for nearly five months for his criticism of the installed regime in Pakistan backed by its powerful military. Contingent of Miawali police cordoned of the session court premises since Wednesday morning to re-arrest the Tehrike and South workers booked in the May 9 cases. On Tuesday, all 37 PTI workers were acquitted by the anti-terrorism courts in Sargoda, including former MNA Amjad Ali Khan, but Miawali City Police arrested them from the compounds of the Sargoda Central Jail as soon as they came out of the prison and took them to Miawali under Section 16 of the Maintenance of Public Order. Israeli helicopter gunships, attack drones and warplanes strike Rafah as Palestinian fighters engage Israeli troops in running street battles. At least 14 Palestinians have been killed following Israeli airstrikes on residential buildings in northern Gaza City. Meanwhile, Hezbollah has launched a major drone and rocket attack targeting military bases in Israel's north, and Israeli forces have responded with a deadly bombing in southern Lebanon as fears grow that border clashes descend into all-out war. At least 37,232 people have been killed and 85,037 wounded in Israel's genocide in Gaza since October 7th.